My name is Marisa Bernotti. I am a multidisciplinary artist from Uruguay, South America, and my city is Dolores. I'm presenting a show in Dolores in the Lacan Guasú Museum and it's uh, the name is Phil. Phil asked uh, the viewer and also myself about uh, the sense and the feelings. Can we separate the, the sense uh, from the feelings or not? This show it uh, consists of four series of work a uh, uh, four body of work that I uh, been working for more than one year. The first uh, and the second series uh, of body of work it's a journal and handbag that are not handbag. A journal is about myself. Uh, I've been writing in my journal since I was 13 years old. Uh, but I figured out three, year, three years ago that I had been uh, drawing all uh, my imaginary world, like abstract drawings, houses, characters, uh, in, a, in a mode that I didn't know before. So when I figured out that, I went to my older journals and I saw I was doing this from ever. So journal talked to me and tell me that uh, I'm an artist and I'm been an artist since uh, I was uh, really small. So it's about what do you think uh, you are and what uh, the other think you are. Uh, and at the same time, I'm developing a handbag that are not handbag and it's about the contrast, how the people see you and how do you feel inside? Uh, a lot of uh, people have preconcepts about us, and uh, even if we if we explain our nature, they want to keep their, their preconcepts and can't see what we really are. So in this uh, body of work, I took some handbags and deconstructed them and becoming new things with paint and a sculptural ob object. Uh, both series are also with fluorescent paint. And this is about uh, to talk about, uh, even if you go to the shadows or the dark, because you don't want to show yourself, you have your own light and this light is shining and needs to go out. I invite you to show your, uh, your own light. The third uh, body of work is uh, endometriosis. It's about a, a disease that I had in, a, in my 16, was, I was uh, really young. Um, and I spent a lot of time in the hospital and more than a year uh, in a really bad pain. 
Uh, I want to talk about endometriosis because it's a, um, it's a disease that uh, needs more research and also needs that we talk more about it. Uh, there are a lot of women who suffer this disease, uh, but we don't know. Uh, it, it's hard to diagnostic also. So I invite all of us to talk about endometriosis. Uh, is, a, is a work that I want to, to talk because it causes too much pain, a pain that makes you be disabled. So it's, uh, begin it's not uh, uh, maybe a disease that you will die for, but cause a lot of things that you, you really go in a, in, a, in a situation of pain. And I, I, I got that situation uh, in a really deep feeling of uh, to say goodbye to my family. Uh, so I really want to, to open uh, the discussion about this and to have uh, this voice about this disease. Body of work number four, it's uh, about the pandemic as the name is first semester 2020. And this is a body of work that uh, uh, I started to work in last year. And it, it has the coincidence that I was in a international resident with 19 uh, other artists uh, from all over the world and also with uh, teachers and mentors from the School of Visual Art in New York. And this is, was the, an opportunity for me to put in the table this, uh, this uh, talk about the pandemic. I realized that even uh, no matter in what uh, place of the world you are, all of us share the same feeling of uh, uh, chaos, stress, and uncertainty. But at the same time, we want to keep us down and be positive and defend life and the happiness. Uh, so it's a question about how long will be last this uh, situation of COVID and what we feel. This is uh, all the work is about feeling uh, in this uh, pandemic situation, but without uh, lost a uh, positive message. Mm -hmm.